we've got a Karen in the flesh. Take a look. Oh, this is a, a, I don't care. So I am tired of their fireworks. I am tired of their, their music. I'm tired of their music. Do you own this park? Do you own this park? I live in this park. You don't live in this park. This is a public park. It's 11 o'clock. You want to come with me? I'm dressing for Karen. This is a park. Do not don't do that don't to me. Don't. Don't. You do hey, not. Back up. Hey. Back up. Leave back me alone. Back up. I'm not going to back up. You cannot up. put your hands. On people, yeah. lady. She put her hands on me. If you have a problem, me. then call the cops. She put her now hands you're putting your hands on me. Back up, or I'm calling the cops. I, I have call them. Hey, I call wait them. Wait for them on the sidewalk, then. I don't know because where they are. Because if you put, put your hands on it again, we're gonna feel really bad if we put our hands on you. Oh, I don't care where they are. Party. 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 <laughs> Regardless of whatsoever situation we find ourselves, I don't think it's right for anyone to put their hands on anybody. What do you think? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section. Karen here picks a fight with a random stranger all because he lost his money gambling. Take a look. Go do a smart blow, bro. Cash out. Let's go. No, no, no. Let go. Let go. Let go. Hey, hey, hey. You have no idea. You lose your kid's college fund or something? What's that? You lose your kid's college fund or something now? That's how my kid's college fund. You have no idea. You start with strangers. No, he started it with me. Got you want to bring it? Bring it. Let's bring no it. It's bringing nothing. Then why are you talking to me? Because you got a problem with people that. So I've got a problem with you and interrupting. No. You don't know. What you're talking about? Sounds like let go, making let go, our line let go. Take let go. Let's What's go. that? You making our line take longer? I'm going out of your line, dude. Uh, whatever. Fucking hell. There you go. Bring it. Bring it. Just swing. Bring it. Swing. Yeah. Swing. You probably got swing. four lawyers, bro. Swing. Bring more than four. Swing it. More Just than swing. four. Oh, swing. Oh, swing. You're in line talking. Yeah. So are you? Take your twenty dollar ticket up there, dude. There you go. Right there, right there. Right there. What's up? I just hope that someday Karen wouldn't come in contact with somebody that would actually deal with him. The rate at which he's going. What do you think? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section. Who do you think is in the wrong here? Is it the retail worker or the customer? Take a look. This lady just closed the window on me because I asked her for hot. And all her customers are going to be sitting here waiting because she was so rude and closed the window on me. I'm here every day. I will get you far. This is ridiculous. She told me that I didn't get a burrito, so I can't get the salsa. We offered to pay, and she still. Y'all seen that, right? Y'all seen that? You seen that? Girl, I don't give a darn about you recording me. Okay. I'm gonna just let the people move know. Out, move out. Oh. Um, okay. Move. Oh, but you made me wait here. Would you move? I, these are all my managers and they see me. So would you move? Then they need to make sure to have the right type of people Girl, to work at this place. Girl, whatever. Please move. You so ghetto.
I think that customers should try at least to treat all the retail workers with some respect. Why? Because they're not being paid enough to be harassed or mistreated. What do you think? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section. Cameron refused to sell drinks to students because they were supposed to be in school, she said. Take a look. This is actually unreal. Making money. Kicking us out because we're in school. You're not in school though. Exactly. Therefore, we get out at 2.38. My school is ending at 2.33 p.m. Okay. So that's when I get out of school. So can I be in here? And I bet all those kids that walked out, walked up here at 2.35 p.m., they all were just on the screen being denied sales for what? Because that's what you're not, because you guys are bad kids. Or, I mean, not just, I mean. Uh, it's not bad kids. They're released. No, it's the bad kids that are ruining your favorite Oh, No, it's her. When we had to, we had to have the cops, when we had to kind of have the cops up here because of your son. Twice. What? Twice? Him. Oh, inform me, inform me, inform me, inform me. Because run in the mouth, and then he eventually, he did go away. When? He likes to run the mouth. When? When was this? Please, when? All last week, honey. All last week, so the cops came here twice last week? Call the cops, and then we'll have you removed. You're going to kick us out because we're in school. For what reason? I, well, I just came in here to get a drink, and you're the one denying them to be in here. You're telling us, as soon as we walk in, you say you guys have to get out. Hey, I'll be there soon. Hold on. Are you almost here? No, I'll be there soon. Oh, yeah. I am a... Him too. Get in the drink. Please don't put me on your camera, baby. Oh, no, don't worry. Don't worry. No, you just oh, need to go. No, I don't need to go. I don't need to. They're right. getting me a drink. It's private property. Come on. It's private property. Come on, because yeah. they ain't got nothing to do with it. It's a lot of people. Do it. Do it. Do it. We're getting drinks, and you're telling... Okay, so you're calling the cops because I'm recording you? I want to hear that phone call. Right, let's just go, because this is ridiculous. Yeah, those did happen. I will be calling your corporate yes, office, too. Yes, I need an office. You're like, I'm going to be so much. Good, because I'm in school, apparently. I'm in school. All right, we just have... What's your name? What's your, what's her name? I, I need to know her name. Let's go, Brandon. All right, so this is this is Just East don't Fort come here no more. <laughs> no, it's fine. I'm going to come here. I'm going to come here tomorrow Just morning. Just don't come here no more. I cannot believe that Karen actually called the cops on those students for not being in school at the time. Unbelievable. Who is the Karen? Take a look at this. Oh. Hi, how are you today? Who was who was talking to us back there? Do you have a question? About a different question? About somebody saying you don't have to be this difficult? It doesn't have to be that difficult to order a sandwich. There's a way to order it and it just confuses the cooks in the front. Just so if I don't if I don't want my sandwich with everything on it, we're not you just allowed said, you to say that at the beginning? Because when they put it in it it's all it already prompts up to the front. Everything you say back there goes all the way to that front. So it just confused them. So they start making it with everything on it, and then you say you don't want it, and you just want bacon. So it confuses the cooks. Okay, the but there's a, nice, there's a nicer way. The best way to order a sandwich bacon. Okay, but there's a nicer way to say stuff. And there's a what, proper way to order food. So All by right. The same if you don't want your job, the if you don't want your job, just quit. Ma'am, if you don't know how to order food, then go somewhere else. Don't play with me. Ma'am, don't play with me. I'm not going to go ahead and pay. For, go ahead. Here, take your card. Cancel that order that's coming up. Take your card, please. Thank you, sir. Have a great day. Yep. You too. Yep. I love the way the manager handled the situation. That was great. What do you think? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section. Why is it that some people get up in the morning and they decide that, you know what? I just want to make someone's life miserable today. Take a look at this. Yeah, can you make it caramel mocha? Oh, okay, so you don't know what the $2 caramel mocha is? I know what it is. Oh, so why did you have to go to the manager? Large. Okay. The ice coffee flavor is caramel, hazelnut, pumpkin spice, and fresh vanilla. Just give me pumpkin spice then since I didn't get the caramel mocha that I just asked for. Pumpkin spice. Okay. Two, four, 
with my coffee can someone replace it now is that spit in it yes with my McDonald's coffee. Could you replace it? I'm very sorry about that. We did change the coffee. Again, you cannot record. If I need to get the police officer in the back, I will. Could you change my coffee? No, you can leave, ma'am. Thank you. I paid for a coffee. I'm not I can satisfied. give you a refund, but I'm not Yes, I get a refund. And you, again, you need to stop recording. So okay, can you please give me a refund? Could you replace my coffee or give me a refund? Out this um, coffee, I have a receipt. Could you have her even replace it? Yep, she or? said she's refunding it right now. She's okay. taking care of it for you. Okay, so okay. I just want my refund. Yeah, okay, yeah. She was just having issues with the recording just on the, on the private property. So oh, they don't said I, I, can I can record and send them a video of my treatment here. Is that what they said? Well, that, if that's what they told yes. you, yeah, that's fine. As long as they told you that and you have conversations. Can I have your name, please? Can you wait, please? That should be one six. Thank you, um, yep. Maryville Police. Nope, I'm Holbert. You're Holbert. in Maryville, but I'm Holbert. Holbert yeah. Police? Okay. Yeah, that's me. So what happened today, if you mind me asking? My coffee has spit in it. Spit in it? Yes. Thank you so much. Thank is this, you. Is this yours too? Yes, you can keep it. Oh, okay. I appreciate it. Alrighty. All set? Yes. Just so you know, I wasn't here. I just happened to be here for the incident earlier, so. Oh, McDonald's having problems like that? Yeah, a big problem, yeah, yeah. But with the, one it might of their be employees. the customer service. It's actually one of their employees, so. But, okay, you all set? Yes. All right, well, hopefully you get a coffee somewhere that doesn't have spit in it, right? Thank you, yeah, yeah. officer, what again? Wakely. Two weeks. Wakely, hopefully you get a coffee without spit in it. I'm sorry <laughs> for talking over you. No, you're fine, you have a good one, okay? Okay. That customer, Karen, was unreasonable. After she drank a coffee, she took it back for an exchange, claiming that there is spit in the coffee. Who does that? Unbelievable. We've got a Karen in the wild at CVS. Take a look. If you watch this video to the end, please do not forget to indicate in the comment section. Calm down, Karen.